studio. Uh, finally, week one is upon us. Uh, some great games this Friday, Chris. But first, uh, we had a little business to take care of this past Friday with preseason football. Welcome. I'm Zach Dean. This is Chris Boyle. Uh, Chris, preseason in the books. What stood out to you on Friday? Well, the city of Port Orange stood out. I mean, the fact that <laughs> Spruce Creek and Atlantic, both a couple of teams that mm -hmm. felt highly disrespected, able to go out and get uh, a couple of nice wins, Spruce Creek, uh, holding Lake Brantley, a district champion, only seven points. Their, their defense forced four turnovers. Atlantic, really a, a surprise. They, they made me kind of eat my words. I picked 45-7, and uh, I'll own that. That was not a, not a good pick in retrospect. They beat New Smyrna 13-7. to They've won their last two games. They beat Warner in the spring. Don't they call beat, the streak. They beat New Smyrna after going 0-10 last year. I mean, they've got to feel really good going into this season. Yeah, Matt Dixon looks like he has that team headed in the right direction. And uh, Spruce Creek, I didn't know they won. That's interesting. I didn't hear. Mm -hmm. uh, what stood out to me were a couple things. Obviously, I don't know if it stood out, but just kind of reaffirmed, uh, I was at university, and that offense is as advertised. Marquise Mickens, Lorenzo Lingard, both of them were unstoppable. Uh, but the defense as well for university, I mean, they came out and, and really did, did well. And I know they lost four or five starters, but they held the land to right at 200 yards of offense. Jordan Wilson was bottled up in the backfield. Jemison can never really get going. So uh, university seems as advertised. And then obviously uh, the other big thing that kind of stood out was Flagler Palm Coast. Uh, Kayshawn Bird had himself a day, as yeah, a, a, as he always does, but against a really good opponent in Gainesville. Uh, I don't think any of us had FPC winning, and, and, and you know a 21-17 really solid win over a good team. Now, albeit Gainesville may not be as strong as they were last year, but regardless, that uh, like Atlantic and Spruce Creek, a statement win from FPC. Yeah, you got a bunch of rivalry games this week. I'm really fascinated by Mainland Deland. Uh, yep. Hopefully, Stephon Bruton is going to be healthy enough to go it sounds like it uh, Demarcus Adams really shined in their kickoff classic mm -hmm. win with uh, three really long catches all over 45 yards you got University of Deltona you got FBC Matanzas this is gonna be a really really fun week yeah fun first week uh, we're gonna have all the action for you on Friday uh, we'll be back later this week to give some predictions give our takes on the games uh, to look for that uh, I am Zach Dean this is Chris Boyle Co college football high school football is back in the area we'll see you later this week Thank you.